Hey, it's Drew Bennett from Ben Spark Family Adventures back with another toy video. This time I am talking about Snapships from Play Monster. They sent me six of their new mini drones for free so that I could build them and then make one of the fusion builds from them. So, they're, well, actually, we make two fusion builds one with the complex, which is the bad guys, those are in red, and one with the uh, the Forge, which is the good guys, and those guys are in green. So, uh, you know, you can see I've got these these individual boxes. If I show you the green ones, it's going to look weird with the green screen. So, um, I've got these, and I'm going to build each of the individual sets so that you can see what they look like, and then we'll build the final build, the fusion build. The first drone that I'm going to build is the DA-63 turbine drone which is uh, one of the forge drones and it has a disc launcher so i'll show you that once it's built here is the completed da63 turbine drone all built and you can see it has the um the disc launcher so you just push that and it'll shoot the discs right out and they, they go pretty far so don't shoot at anybody's eye uh, but that is the a da63 turbine drone let's build the next drone the next build is the BP-48 Biped Mech, and this uh, this mech here has movable legs, and it also has rapid-fire launchers, so if you just push down on this, it shoots the little projectiles right out. Uh, this is for ages 8 and up. Also, make sure that you're not firing this at anybody's face, and keep these small parts away from smaller children. Let's move on to the next one. The RL-55 Assault Drone has a rotating launcher so you turn this to the side and we launch out the projectiles that way so again they go flying pretty far you gotta go and find them afterwards uh and this one i like this one because it's another flyer and i, I do like the flyers got some good uh pieces to it a lot of uh artillery on it and that is a cool looking uh, drone so let's take those three put them together and create the fusion build so in order to build the fusion build, you're going to have to go to snapships.com and there you look up your individual uh, set that you have and it will show you where to find the fusion build instructions, which is a PDF file. So this is the fusion build instructions for the MD Switch 1, which is a, a mech that you build from all of the pieces or many of the pieces from the three sets there for the forge uh drones so we put those drones together and make a larger build and that's what we're going to do now if you have any trouble with uh taking apart any of the snapships pieces there is a tool that is included with each of the sets that allows you to help pull off some of those pieces it'll save your fingernails and it'll make it a lot easier to take things apart and i mean these are quick and easy to take apart for the most part but if there's anything that's like um a, a, a small uh, thin spot that can be hard to get off so like this one to get your finger underneath that that is easier to use the tool to do so included with each set are some of these connector pieces so that when you're building the fusion build you're going to use these pieces to connect some of the snapships pieces together to make a, a larger piece so by using two of these connectors plus these three pieces, I can put them all together to make one larger piece. This is the completed MD Switch 1, which is a more of a biped mech than anything else. Uh, it uses the rotational uh, launcher, the rapid launcher, and a lot of the pieces from the three drones that, that you have there. Uh, I personally would be more of a fan of it being a uh, like a um, well actually I would I would like to see it more of a ship than um, a biped mech um, I think a ship would really look um, pretty pretty sweet uh, there and I would probably want to rebuild it in such a way so that it looks more like a flyer than a walker um, it's just I mean it's neat if you like mechs but uh if you like uh flying um like i do like that more then uh, you want to rebuild this again to me something that can fly um so that is the uh, md switch one let's take a look at all of the complex drones and then build the co the fusion 
build for those drones. This is the K-Dive drone, and the K-Dive drone is very much like a, uh, a dragonfly, and it's got a really cool look to it, nice colors, and it also has the rapid fire launcher there. Just push that across and you're gonna fire these projectiles all around the room. Uh, let's move on to the next build. And here we have the K-Crawler and the K-Crawler, you know, it's like this spidery type thing coming at you. Uh, it has the disc launcher on the top of it. So you can just push that in and shoot out those discs. Those discs go flying pretty good. Uh, it's spring loaded. So you just push it and it'll spring right back. Uh, that is the K crawler. So we'll move on to the last one of the drones. This is the K swarm, which is a strike drone. It has the rotating launcher on the front. Uh, it has some really nice black and silver or dark gray and silver looks with red. You know, the colors of the complex are just a lot cooler than the colors of the forge, in my opinion. Uh, so let's take those three drones, put them together, and let's make our uh, new fusion build. For our second fusion build, we're going to go back to snapships.com, and there we're going to find the fusion build instructions for the K-form, which is what we're going to do, what we're going to create while we put these uh, three mechs together, or three drones, mechs, all sorts of things together. We're going to put them together, and we're going to make the K-form. And this is the finished K form, which is the fusion of the K dive, K swarm, and K crawler. Um, K for complex, uh, so complex begins with a K. Uh, and I think this is a much better build than the MD Switch 1. Uh, it is a flyer, it just still kind of retains uh, the, the look of some of the individual build pieces, but it's just really a lot cooler in my opinion. Uh, it has the rotational launcher and it also has the disc launcher. It is just full of firepower, great colors and much better look that, to me uh, than the um, MD Switch 1, which is just, um, you know, I. I don't know. I like I like the complex stuff a lot a lot better. Uh, anyway, this is Drew Bennett from Ben Spark Family Adventures. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter as Ben Spark, Facebook.com slash Ben Spark Family Adventures, and you can find me here making videos all the time. I'd like to thank the folks from Play Monster for sending me all these sets for free so that I could do this video. Uh, they are really cool and fun toys, and you have so much more that you can do. So if you don't like the look of of any of these. Take it apart and build it to battle to your specifications. You can also use, they have an augmented reality app that you can use that you can play even more and extend the game uh, out further. Plus, there's also their YouTube channel and a whole bunch of other things. If you're interested in purchasing some of these, I have affiliate links that are in the show notes. So if you're interested, my Amazon link is there. Um, Snapships are found all over the place and uh, they're really fun. So... Thanks for watching.